bit. Well, it's a uh, slob of PB. Um, Why don't you do a quick, uh, I guess, range test? Uh, just a video with uh, the TMC here. Um, if you've been to uh, Wacky Warriors in uh, Wentzville, uh, you might have seen this a few times. I guess it was like two weeks ago. And the old SL68 too. I picked this up not too long ago, but uh, it works very well. So uh, I'm just going to... I'll turn you around so you can see. Shoot that. There. Dock right about there. That's what I. Try to adjust it so you can see it. Paint's not acting very nice today. Ooh, that's a hit. I mean, I'm counting the ones that ricochet as hits, but clipped it. We gotta get some tape on this tank or something. Sweaty, oh, there we go. Not so good for sweaty hands. So that is the SL68 too. Uh, this is the revamped model of it. So it, uh, we got, we've had this thing for about, uh, I bought it a couple weeks ago. But it's been me and my buddy's hands for a couple years, so. That's that. Now normally, I'll run a peanut tank on this thing. It's lighter. And it's a little more wieldy, but 
That uh, is our MagFed Maker parts. Grips original stock MagFed Maker stock sights. It's aftermarket, some Walmart red dot, but it works pretty well. Magpul AFG with a rail to make it compatible with that uh, hand guard. Let's see what kind of grouping we can get with this thing. feet in the water because why not it's a nice day And that, I don't know if I can zoom this in or not. No, I guess not. Can I rotate that? Nope, okay. But, um, yeah, that's, uh, and that's, I don't know what the distance on that is, but that's pretty much it.